Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Wendy's Kooky Crochet Tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to work into the front post and back post of a stitch. Now, as you can see, I've already done a, a row of um, double crochets right here. That's just to kind of get us started. And if you like what you see on this video, please subscribe to my channel and um, like the video. It really helps me out a lot. And I've got some fun new things coming up like a granny square dress and you definitely don't want to miss that. So here I'm showing you that right there. That is the post right there. So it's the bottom part of that stitch is the post. The top part's the stitch. The bottom part is the post right there. So that's that's what I'm going to be working around. So you see how I go under that and I go around that post and I'm pulling up a loop there to do my double crochet. And it creates a ridge right there. It kind of it bumps it out and creates like a ridge right there. And it's a really neat looking uh, way to crochet. Um, if you don't know how to do a double crochet, I'm going to link that video below. And here what I'm doing is I just made two double crochet stitches around the front post of the stitches on the previous round. And you can do that with pretty much any stitch. You could do it with, you know, the single crochet, half double, double, triple. You can do that with most stitches like that. It looks especially good when you want to do ribbing like in a corset. So here I'm going to do that again in the front post. So the front post is what is facing towards you. Towards the front is the front post there. And so I'm just going to work my way into or around that front post right there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to chain two and I'm going to turn. And you see how that looks right there. I have two in the front post right there. So I'm going to turn my work there. I'm going to now it's called back post because it is what is not facing you. It's what's facing the back of the work. So it's, it's a little bit weird doing it that way, but you'll get the hang of it. So now I'm marking my double crochet into the back post right there. And um, from the previous round that is. And so when I turn it around now, I'm going to work normal, but I'm going to not work into those two stitches because I've already worked into the post and I don't wanna add stitches. And so now I'm just going to double crochet down until I get to where I worked into the front post earlier and I'm going to work into that back post again. So I'm continuing to double crochet all the way down and now I've gotten to that back post. So I'm working behind. So I'm working into that back post. The back is what's not, what's not facing me. Front is what's facing me. So that is the back post right there. And I'm going to finish that off with a double crochet in that last stitch there. And um, there you have how to work a um, front post and back post stitches. And um, this again, this looks really, really cool when you have a corset or something like that that you're trying to work into. If you like this video, please consider subscribing to my channel and um, pushing the like button. Thanks for watching and happy crocheting everyone.